Are hydrogen cars greener than electric cars? Well, hydrogen has long been touted as the future for passenger cars. In this video, we will show you the top 7 hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles, which simply run on pressurized hydrogen from a fueling station and produce zero carbon emissions from its exhaust. Number 7. Mercedes-Benz GLC F-Cell Daimler AG seems to be the oldest producer of fuel cell electric vehicles. Its first generation F-Cell was introduced back in 2002 and had a range of 100 miles with a top speed of 82 miles per hour. This was based on the Mercedes-Benz A-Class series. It gave way to the B-Class with a more powerful F-Cell electric engine rated at 100 kilowatts with a range of about 250 miles. It could have higher specs because the B-Class has bigger space for accommodating tanks of compressed hydrogen storage pressure and fuel cell technology advances. The 350 bar hydrogen tanks for hydrogen storage contain enough fuel for a 248 mile drive. Using a 700 bar tank, the range is extended 70% to 421 miles. The hydrogen tanks are placed inside the central tunnel, running the length of the car since there's no need for a prop shaft to send power to the rear wheels. Mercedes-Benz only made some hundred of the GLC F-Cell, as manufacturing costs for this model were high. The car was used for business promotions and was never offered for sale to the public. No one was surprised when the company pulled the plug on the further development of the model. This came just days after the company talks with Volvo to deploy the fuel cell technology for heavy duty trucks. I guess that's a more profitable market for them. Number 6. Hyundai Nexo The hydrogen fuel cell powered Nexo is one to look out for in an SUV. The only fuel cell SUV for now that is. This beauty and power come ready to give you a driving pleasure with a 95 kilowatt fuel cell stack and 40 kilowatt hour battery pack that can power an electric motor to deliver 161 horsepower with 291 pound feet of torque. A single speed transmission sends power directly to the front wheels. 0 to 60 miles per hour is achieved in 8.4 seconds. Two trims are available, the standard blue and the limited. The blue trim offers a range of 380 miles with 17 inch wheels. The limited edition comes heavier with a hands-free power lift gate, an extra large sunroof, ventilated seats, a heated steering wheel, Hyundai's blind spot view monitor, a 360-degree camera, a remote parking feature, and an upgraded Krell audio system, and offers a range of 354 miles. Nothing uniquely fancy or extraordinary with the interior here. Users get the usual Hyundai setup with its two-spoke steering wheel, digital instrument panel, and push-button transmission controls. A general pleasant trip awaits you in this beauty. Starting price is $60,120 for the standard blue and $63,570 for the limited. Number 5. BMW iHydrogen Next BMW is collaborating with Toyota to bring this iHydrogen Next to the pilot production phase in 2022. It is a fuel cell electric SUV presently undergoing rigorous road tests. 2025 will see its series production, that is, if infrastructure and market conditions are right. BMW has already tested the car's various systems, the hydrogen storage tank, battery pack, and electric motors separately, but this is the first time the drivetrain has been evaluated in its entirety under real-world conditions. Although with some alterations, the iHydrogen being its eco-signature, it looks very similar to the current generation X5. It also has a unique blue tinted radiator grille, a set of lightweight alloy wheels, and a revised rear diffuser with blank doff exhaust outlets and blue trim. It is powered by a pair of electric motors located at each axle, which have a combined output of 369 bhp. They're the company's fifth generation drive motors. The fuel cell is supplied by two different 700 bar hydrogen storage tanks, which occupy the same space as the gearbox and drive shaft in the combustion engine X5. Altogether, the tanks can hold 6 kilograms of hydrogen. BMW guarantees that this fuel cell powered car will perform well in all weather conditions. It would not experience a range decrease due to cold weather that regular battery powered vehicles experience. Number 4. Honda Clarity Fuel Cell In the Clarity Fuel Cell, the fuel cell assembly turns the hydrogen into electricity, which powers an electric motor producing 174 horsepower and 221 pound-feet and 360 miles of range. It speeds up to 100 kilometers per hour in 9 seconds. 
There are two hydrogen pressure tanks behind and under the rear seat of the Honda that hold 5 kilograms of hydrogen for a range of 650 kilometers. Just as it discontinued the EV variant of the Clarity, Honda is also halting the fuel cell Clarity production. The show will end by August 2021. The company will ensure the Clarity fuel cell is still available for lease through 2022, and Honda will continue to support its Clarity customers in the marketplace. So long, Clarity. Number 3. Hyundai iX35 Fuel Cell Hyundai implemented its vision of a safe, efficient future with a serial production in 2013, the iX35 Fuel Cell. It won Hyundai's Car of the Future Award at the 2013 Brussels Motor Show. As with all fuel cell vehicles, the Hyundai iX35 Fuel Cell produces zero emissions with an electric motor that generates a power output of 100 kilowatts. It accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in 12.5 seconds and achieves top speeds of 160 km per hour. The hydrogen composite tanks in the iX35 fuel cell are made of an aluminum alloy and carbon fiber composite material and hold 5.64 kg. This gives the iX35 fuel cell a range of up to 594 km per tank. The fuel, which is compressed hydrogen at a pressure of 700 bar, is placed in two gas cylinders a smaller 40-liter unit in front of the rear axle and a 104-liter tank behind the rear axle. The iX35 fuel cell utilizes 0.95 kilograms of hydrogen for 62 miles and has a maximum gas tank capacity of 5.64 kilograms. The front wheels are driven by a 65 kilowatt, equivalent to 87.2 bhp, electric motor through a single-speed reducer gear. It comes fitted with a 24 kilowatt battery developed by LG Chemicals. It functions primarily to assist the fuel cell stack when high power demand is at its greatest. The battery pack is also used to harvest waste energy from the regenerative braking system. Other than the battery and fuel system, every other aspect of the iX35 fuel cell looks like its regular gas powered twin. Number 2 Toyota Mirai. Mirai is a Japanese word for the future. The company has chosen this name to inform us that they are certainly set for the future. Like other fuel cell electric vehicles, the Toyota Mirai is powered by a fuel cell that generates electricity for its onboard electric motor by producing a chemical reaction. The vehicle's tailpipe expels water vapor, and unlike battery-powered electric vehicles, the Mirai can be fueled with a tank of hydrogen in a few minutes. The 2021 Mirai sees an extreme body design upgrade that sports the looks of a Lexus. It has a fuel cell powertrain with rear-wheel drive. This vehicle can cover 402 miles on a tank of hydrogen. The fuel cell electric powertrain converts hydrogen to electricity to power the electric motor. It produces 182 horsepower and sends power to the rear wheels via a one-speed direct drive transmission. It reaches 60 miles per hour in 9.1 seconds. Standard interior details include heated and power-adjustable seats, keyless entry and ignition, faux leather upholstery, and a 12.3-inch infotainment touchscreen. All Mirai models come with a $15,000 fuel credit and 21 days of complimentary vehicle rentals when traveling out of areas without hydrogen fueling stations. Its price starts at $50,000. Number 1. Hyperion XP1 Hypercar after spending 10 years in the works, the XP1 is ready to debut in 2022 with some mind-blowing specs. The Hyperion XP1 is said to have a 2.2 second 0 to 60 mile per hour time and a 221 miles per hour top speed. It is built on a carbon titanium monocoque chassis with a curb weight of fewer than 2,275 pounds and also offers 1,000 plus miles of range before needing a refuel. Aside from building this hydrogen-powered car, Hyperion focuses on building a network of fueling stations to address the primary drawbacks of hydrogen-powered cars. Hydrogen has the advantage of quick refueling and a large if not infinite supply, but the refueling stations are very sparse at the moment. This is what Hyperion hopes to address. Like Tesla's supercharger network, Hyperion plans to build hydrogen refuel stations but won't be making as many stations as Tesla. The XP1 offers more than 1,000 miles of range, even up to 1,016 miles at a combination of 55% city and 45% highway driving. Hyperion plans to manufacture 300 units of the XP1s. 
It will have an all-wheel drive with a 3-speed transmission and ultra capacitors to buffer the output of the fuel cell. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out these videos shown on your screen right now.